And now on to our dinosaur of the day, Xinjiang Titan, which was a request from PaleoMike716 via our Patreon and Discord, so thanks. I also happen to find the pinyin for this dinosaur, so you could also call it Xinjiang Zhulong. Oh, interesting. So it ends in long, which often is just translated as saurus. But in this case, I translated it as Titan. I think it's the Zhulong that makes it Titan. That's my guess. I don't know Chinese well enough to know. <laughs> <laughs> it was a mementosaurid sauropod that lived in the Middle Jurassic and what is now Xinjiang, China, in the Chikatai Formation. And the standout feature of this mementosaurid, you might guess, since it's a mementosaurid, mm. is its extremely long neck. Yeah, they do tend to have just insane necks. Yes. They have necks like diplota kids have tails. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And the neck of Xinjiang Titan was even longer than Mementosaurus. There's one Mementosaurus species neck estimated to be about 39 feet or 12 meters long, which is, there are dinosaurs that long, <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> whole bodies. But Xinjiang Titan's neck is estimated to be up to 49 feet or 15 meters long. Oh, boy. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, it had the longest neck among Mementosaurids that are known so far. Hmm. That's quite a feat. I wish there was a way to know the extremes of dinosaurs. Like, we'll never know exactly how big the biggest dinosaur is because we won't know if we found the biggest one. Mm hmm But I would love to know, yeah, how long could those necks get? I mean, I wouldn't have guessed 50 feet. <laughs> <laughs> That's ridiculous. Yeah. That's a lot of stress on the shoulders and the base of the neck to hold that off the ground. Yes, that's true. So, but like I said, there might be other dinosaurs out there with longer necks. We just don't have enough fossils to confirm. So, for example, Supersaurus may have had a neck that was up to nearly 56 feet or 17 meters long. Maybe. Now... Xinjiang Titan is estimated to be about 98 to 105 feet or 30 to 32 meters long and weigh 40 metric tons. Its thigh bone that was found is about 5.4 feet or 1.65 meters long. Just the thigh bone. <laughs> yeah, that's very big, but it's in the realm of pretty normal for large, really large sauropods. Yeah. It did have relatively short hind limbs, and it also had a long whip-like tail, and it stood on four columnar legs, typical of sauropods. The type species is Xinjiang Titan shanshanensis. They found an incomplete skeleton, but it includes a very complete vertebral column, the neck, and a nearly complete tail. Oh, nice. So that estimate of the neck isn't just a big extrapolation from one or two vertebra. No, it's really cool. It's the most complete vertebral or spinal column found in Asia so far. These vertebrae were all found articulated in situ. The neck had 18 vertebrae and together is estimated to be that 49 feet or 15 meters long. This is according to Zhang and others in 2018. Yeah, I want to get into some details on the neck, but first we need to go over some definitions and I got these definitions, thank you, to sauropod vertebra picture of the week. So the main part of the vertebra is the centrum. And then there's a ball in the front of the centrum called the condyle. And then there's a socket at the back of the centrum called the cotyle. And the condyle and the cotyle fit together. So like a ball and socket. Mm -hmm. Now there's a range for how long the neck was. And that's based on whether you use the minimum or maximum centrum length in your calculations. And that's based on whether or not you include the front or anterior condyle, because sometimes they're completely buried in the cotyles. And sometimes, like in camels, they don't reach each other. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you also have to take into account how much cartilage you assume was in the neck. Yeah. So basically how close together the bones are. Yeah. Because they weren't going bone to bone. But there might have been a little gap or a whole bunch of gap. Yes. So the neck might have been shorter or longer, depending on how you calculate it. And Zhang and others, they use the maximum centrum lengths. However, Matt Wadel on Sauropod Vertebra Picture of the Week estimated the neck to be closer to about 44 feet or 13.4 meters long using the minimum centrum lengths, partly based on condyles being buried in the cotyles in a couple of those vertebrae. Oh, only 44 feet. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you call that a neck. <laughs> 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 
So in addition to the neck, they also found part of the skull, part of the pelvis, and most of the left hind limb. These fossils were found in 2012 by a joint expedition between Jilin University, Shenyang Normal University, and Xinjiang Geological Survey Institute. And Xinjiang Titan was described in 2013 by Wu Wenhao and others. Well, that one got jumped right to the top of the list. They found it in 2012 and described it in 2013. Probably because of the neck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's a lot of preparation work to do, digging out a 40-foot neck and all that work. It's impressive. Yeah. Actually, no, it wasn't because of the neck, because originally they described only two neck vertebrae in addition to other vertebrae part of the pelvis and hind limb. But then Zhang and others re-described all that material and included those 18 neck vertebrae in 2018. And parts of the skeleton were left unexposed and unexcavated the first time around. Okay. So it did take them longer to get through all of that. Yeah. But they knew that there was something there and mm -hmm. they could name it. The genus name refers to Xinjiang and the species name refers to the alternative name for Shanshan, the county where it was found. It was named after the Shanshan Kingdom. And the type specimen of Xinjiang Titan is at the Shanshan Geological Museum. For those of you who listen to our Dinosaur of the Day segment and you like it, please consider becoming a patron. We take new Dinosaur of the Day requests from our patrons and offer a bunch of other perks as well. So check out our page at patreon.com slash inodino or click the link on the left. <laughs> 